Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about the latest Windows 11 25H2 update and also the latest 24H2 update because it is pretty much the same update. And in this update, we have a few known issues that are quite big, one of them even breaking the file explorer. So in this video, we're gonna talk about this. I'm gonna show you what happens in this build if you install it and what are our expectations from Microsoft related to a fix for these issues. So in this video, we are talking about the build 26200.73 or 26100.7309 for version 24H2 and the build code KB5070311. If you've searched for Windows updates recently since the 1st of December, you may have gotten this update. And this update, basically the file explorer is pretty much broken. I'm gonna show you in just a moment. But of course, if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. Fortunately enough, Microsoft is disclosing that the file explorer might flash with a white screen in dark mode, but uh, I can tell you that the proper word shouldn't be might. The proper word is the file explorer will flash because from what I've seen in the comments, everyone that has installed this update has this issue. So let me show you what happens when I open up the file explorer. Check this out. We get a white flashbang basically whenever we're opening it. And this will happen every time we open up the file explorer. It doesn't matter if if we didn't open it yet or if we had opened it before this white thing will happen again and again and this will also happen whenever you're hovering over the different tabs or categories for example if you're going to the gallery section or to the home section this will happen again and again also whenever you are creating a new tab this will happen again when you turn on the details pane or when you turn it off and also when you select more details while copying files this will happen a temporary fix for this would be to go to these three dots and then go to options and then open file explorer 2 select here this pc this will be a quick fix that at least will not show you the white flashbang whenever you're opening up the file explorer but the white flashbang will still appear whenever you're going to gallery or to home or creating a new tab so unfortunately this is just a temporary fix that helps just a bit now microsoft is stating that they are working to resolve this issue and will provide more information when it is available so what's my problem with this is that microsoft had more than enough time to fix this because this update should have been released at least a week ago. They hadn't released it because it was the Thanksgiving week, but they've released it on the 1st of December and they've released it with this huge problem in my opinion because you cannot use File Explorer in dark mode and I'm sure that a lot of users are using dark mode and imagine being late at night doing some editing or whatever gaming and you open up the File Explorer and you get greeted with this. <laughs> it's quite funny if you ask me. Hopefully Microsoft will fix it for the security update that will come most likely next week but keep in mind that we won't have any other feature update for Windows 11 25 H2 on the main release so this is pretty much the last feature update so hopefully Microsoft will fix it for the next update which is the only update left the security update but keep in mind that it is possible that Microsoft doesn't have the time to fix it until that so we could be stuck with this issue until next year which would be something pretty big now my issue is what happens with file explorer how can it be so broken how has Microsoft coded it. I mean, how is it possible that we get this white flashbang? Did they just put a background wallpaper to make it have dark mode or something? I'm not sure. And I'm pretty surprised that we have had Windows 11 for more than four years and Fall Explorer is still not reliable. It still has issues. This is actually so interesting. And hopefully Microsoft will start to improve their updates next year at least and start releasing updates with no known issues as big as these. Because of course, I can accept some small known issues but this is quite big because file explorer is something that we use every day now of course we just have to wait for a fix from microsoft hopefully next week in the security patch now there is also another known issue in this update which is the password icon that might be missing or invisible in the lock screen sign in options okay so this is not such a big issue but microsoft is stating that after installing the august 2025 non-security preview update which was kb5064081 or later updates you might notice is that the password icon is not visible in the sign in options on the lock screen but if you hover over the space where the icon should appear you'll see that the password button is still available yep so it's pretty weird and you just select that placeholder to open the password text box and you can sign in normally hopefully this 
will also be fixed in the next security patch. So I'm curious to see from the comments below. Let me know if you've installed this update. Let me know if you have this issue with the white screens in the file explorer. I certainly have it. It is not something related to my graphics driver or anything like that. It happens on any device. So of course, this was the video for today. I hope you liked it. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. This is Manny from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.